Okay, so in this video we're looking at getting SketchUp data as a solid into Solid Edge. So I'm using the SketchUp app here. So um, I'm just going to start simple. I'm just going to do a do a block um, and extrude that up, just so we've got a um, a solid on there. Okay, I'm going to go and delete the the dude. We don't want the dude. Um, and then we're going to save that into our SketchUp. Um, so I'm going to go into my SketchUp area and let's go and give this a, a a block that's now saving so obviously you're gonna have more complex data than this but so this is very simplified okay so now we're gonna we've got our block saved we're gonna go up here and we're gonna choose not the export so we haven't got the right options but download is gonna give us the STL option so if we go to there that is now we've now got our block STL downloaded so now we're gonna go to FreeCAD so we can go and download this and for this one it's a very simple process in here we're going to go file new and then we're going to go file and we're going to import I'm going to go to my downloads folder choose the STL and I've now got my STL what I need to do is change environments to do what we want so if we go to start and change this to part that's going to give us the part environment if we click on the block and then go to the part option at the top We've got different options, so here we've got create shape from mesh. We're going to choose so shape, select OK, and now we can go and delete the block, and we've now got our feature that we want. So um, we can then go and save that to wherever we want that. So I'm just going to leave that in my downloads folder um, in there. Uh, I'm going to call that block um, new and then we're going to choose to export that so now we can go and export that uh, once we've selected the object on there it's always easier and then we can see we've got all sorts of different files so the obvious one here um, we're going to be looking for um, something that we can open up in our format um, so obviously we've got BREP format but step tends to be the one that most people are going to go for so we've then got that, that file in there got the different standards um, so I'm just going to go with 214 um, obviously if we if we have any issues we can go in here and go and um, save those on there we've now moved to solid edge so we're going to open the file we've got the step file we're going to choose our part template and open that up and there we are we've got that in solid edge this could open in ordered or synchronous doesn't really matter so this one I'm gonna move this to synchronous um, we can then go and use the optimize command in the inspect tab and that's gonna go and improve the quality of that file and we're gonna get our block um, with all those correct sizes on there so we can click on smart dimension and we can view the different sizes on there and we can now synchronously use it whatever we want reference etc hopefully that's been a useful video um, please like, comment, share, etc. That would be great. Thank you very much.